And then uh, coming up this next week, uh, we have uh, our town hall. It's our quarterly town hall on support site. Uh, this is a joint six fleet uh, NSA Naples town hall. So Admiral Fogo will be there, Captain Carpenter, and uh, it'll be in the, in the large theater there on the support site. And uh, chance for folks to ask questions to to our, our bosses, right? And, uh, and and we'll have department heads there as well to to clarify uh, some things. But um, hope folks can attend this uh, this town hall. Um, a little different tag this time, so uh, be able to hear from uh, one of our one of our flag officers, um, Commander Six Fleet. So. Should be should be a really good town hall, and uh, looking forward to everyone coming out for it. Thank you for having me on the show today. Um, just to talk about influenza, it's that time of year again, so uh, the vaccines will be on their way here shortly, and um, I'll be more than happy to come back and, and um, brief everyone, give everyone an update um, when they arrive. So, you know, it's very important to have the vaccine um, because the influenza virus can cause so many complications, and you know can many people can suffer from this. It's not kind of like your typical cold um, illness. Uh, both differ, you know. Um, so we need to build that herd immunity. Um, and that's what we need to look at. So, you know, when people contract the flu, um, you can have serious complications from it. Um, you have high-risk individuals like immune compromised. You have the elderly. You have um, child population, you have pregnant women that are at risk. So it's our job um, to make sure that we're protecting not only ourselves and our family, but the population in general. And you, the best way to do that is to get vaccinated. Keep talking about with yeah. the game with multiple names. I've heard Battle in the Crater, I've heard Volcano Bowl, I've heard Carnival. Bowl, Rumble in the Volcano. Yeah. Uh, regardless, it's the first time that I've seen a football game out there between our, our high school sports. Um, so it should be fun. Yeah, Naples Wildcats versus Shape Spartans. It's gonna it's just, be under the lights too. Yeah, yeah. So the kids here at the high school probably aren't used to playing under the lights. At least, oh, you know, here they maybe at uh, uh, when they go to away games. So this is their second game of the season. I think they played Rota last week. Uh, they, did, um, uh, they lost. I think it was twenty-one seven. Yeah. Score yeah. Something like that. So maybe they can bring it back, turn it around, and uh, and, and put a win in the column this week. Uh, this weekend. Definitely, you know, and you know, playing high school in, in or playing football in high school, there's there's just something special about playing under the lights. You know, and the, there'd be times you'd be like, oh, I wonder what it'd be like to play during the day. But when you play under the lights, you feel like you're the only game on earth that's being played at that time. There's just something you see the crowd, you see the lights are on, like the spotlights on you. You just kind of feel like you're the only only game in town at that point. It's pretty yeah, special. It so. adds some excitement. Definitely adds some excitement to the football games, no doubt.